broadcasting live worldwide. Good morning. My name is Angel Santana. I am the host of Have Faith, Let It Begin. Today is Thursday, September 1st, 2022. And today we begin a new journey, a new calendar month. It's September. And school season is upon us. Now, for some of us, school's already started, maybe a week or two in. And for most of us here in the Northeast, we will begin today and tomorrow, our new season, our new school year. So today, I wanted to take a pause and do a prayer for all schools all over the world. As we all know, last year, there were mass shootings all over the world. And our prayer today is that that is in the past. We'll never forget the children that have been called home. What we don't want is that to happen this year. So I'm hoping and praying that all of you will join me as we do a power of prayer for children, school teachers, school administrators, all of the schools all over the world that we have a free non-violent school year and that all of us can make sure our children remain safe. Have faith, let it begin. Power of Prayer Special School Back Edition starts right now. Welcome to Have Faith. Let it begin. Here's your host, Angel Santana. Ariel, can you say have faith? Let it begin. Say have faith. Let it begin. No, no, no. no? Okay. Hi, Noah. Hi, Noah. Noah. Oh, Noah. <laughs> oh, Happy birthday, Noah. Oh, oh, amazing. Oh, 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 oh. Noah. Have faith. Let it begin. When it starts right now. Good morning, everyone, and welcome to this special edition of Half Faith Let It Begin, September edition. That's right. We begin with a new school year, and for me, as a father, my child, Ariel, my oldest and firstborn, will start her new journey in pre-K, and that starts tomorrow. Well, I figured what better way to kick off the month, kick off the school year, than with a powerful power of prayer. So please join me. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, many of us right now are preparing for the first time to guide our children, send our children to school. New parents, new students, new beginnings, new journeys start within the next day or two. As a parent, I'm nervous. I'm scared. Like all parents, we want our children to be safe. We want them to be healthy. We want their surroundings, their environment to be a place for learning, for fun and laughter. We ask you, Lord, now more than ever, to try and please heal these world of so many violent acts of anger. We ask you, Lord, to try your very best to please keep our children safe, to place your hands all over this world and to cure us of these heinous acts. We're asking you now more than ever, Lord, to be with us, to be with our children, to allow them to know that your presence is here. Allow these children to go into school knowing that it is a day to learn, not a day to worry. We may not remember what tomorrow will bring or what yesterday has brought. What we do know is what you bring to the table, Lord, and that's love. Many people don't understand that because They have dealt with tragedy, sorrow, and with that comes anger, frustration, and 
the inability to want to try and learn who you are. And I understand. I understand. So, Lord, I'm asking you today, please, Lord, hear our prayers. To the families that have suffered tragedy, this is not an easy day for you either. Where on one end, you have families that are excited because their children are starting school. On the other end, there are families out there mourning the loss of those that are not ready to start a new year because they've been called home to be with the Lord. We must never forget those children. We must always remember that God loves us all. That God doesn't punish. That God is here with us. So today, we end this episode with the Lord's Prayer. And we ask each and every one of you to pray each and every morning for these children to keep them safe and out of harm's way. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors. Lead us not into temptation, Deliver us from evil. For yours is the kingdom, the power, and the glory forever and ever. Amen. To all the children all over the world, God is with you. God believes in you. God trusts you. And God is never going to leave your side. To my daughter Ariel, I'm so proud. Go and have a good time and begin your journey. Because it starts right now. May God be with you, may he shine his light upon you, and grant each and every single one of you peace on earth. And never forget, have faith, let it begin. Thank you for listening to another episode of Have Faith, Let It Begin. That's right, Ariel, we're done with another show. And it's always great to have this show with you, man, love. You know, we're going to encourage each and every person to listen to our show every single weekday. That's right. You and I are going to help change the world. Do you think that you can do that for me? Huh? Yeah, you know you can. She does. We want to let you know. and Yes, we encourage you to listen to our show each and every weekday. And it's going to be live at 730. Make sure you're subscribed to our show. Make sure you get ready. Fasten those seatbelts because Ariel and I and my family are going to bring you a new topic, a new story each and every day, right? Isn't that right, Ariel? Yeah. And we impress. <laughs> She's smiling at me. Guys, enjoy your day. <laughs>